to the notch of the presser foot bracket. Put down the presser foot. Replace needle. Power off. Loosen the fastening screw with a screwdriver. Take out the needle. When installing, the needle should be backward and need to be pushed up to the top. Lock the screw tightly with a screwdriver. Part 4. Sewing. Power on. Select a stitch. Button 1. Straight same stitches. Reverse same stitches. 42 stitches. Button 2. Straight same stitches. 111 stitches. Button 3. Button hole stitches. 7 stitches. Click the stitch type to select the required stitches. After the user selects the needle trace, click the mirror key in the screen and automatically flip the left and right direction of the needle. Click plus, minus can adjust width, length and speed. Click the combination key. Different stitch can be combined operation. If we do, click the erase key to erase the selected stitch pattern and redo it select. After the stitch combination is completed, click the storage key to save. The location of the saved stitch is in the stitch custom category 4 inside. Double needle sewing. Install two needles correctly. Click on the single double needle switch. Switch to double stitching, or the needle will be broken. The double needle cannot be threaded through a forced thread. Sewing stitch. Put the fabric under presser foot. Click the confirmation key after the stitch selection is completed. Put down the presser foot. Click Start or Stop button to start sewing. Click Start or Stop button to stop sewing after finishing. Click the cord line. The machine automatically do thread trimmer. Ensure that the needle is lifted at the highest position and then remove the cloth to complete the sewing operation. Part 5. Button hole. Take out the presser foot in the right way. Put the button into button hole presser foot to make sure the button hole's length. Press the button hole presser foot to the notch of the presser foot bracket to complete the installation. Put cloth which is marked with button hole under the presser foot. Pull down the presser foot. Pull down lever. Select the button hole stitch. Click the confirmation key. Click start or stop button to start sewing. Finishing sewing. Click the cord line. The machine automatically do thread trimmer. Lift the presser foot and take out the fabric. Use the cutter to cut the button hole from the middle. Part 6. Embroidery. Power off. Change the presser foot for embroidery operation only. Fix the screw. Take out the extension table. Insert the embroidery connection socket into machine. Take out embroidery frame. Install embroidery cloth. Put the embroidery cloth into embroidery frame. Fix the screw. Power on. Install the embroidery frame buckle correctly into the metal slot of the embroidery machine. Click built-in pattern edit key with 96 embroidery pattern inside. Click the hollow letter key A with 0 to 9 hollow numbers and 26 hollow letters. 
click the flower letter key A with 26 letters in it. Click the U disk icon to select imported or the saved customized patterns. Click the number key A. There are three kinds of fonts. Each of them has a setting for uppercase and lowercase letters, 0 to 9 digits, punctuation and large, medium and small size. Click the pane on the right side with 10 different shapes options. Click the combination key. Different pattern or number or letter or shape can be combined operation. Click built-in pattern edit key. Select the pattern. Click the edit key. Click flower frame switch key to switch the flower frame size. Adjust the position of the pattern by arrow. Click rotate key. Rotate at 1 degree, 10 degrees, or 90 degrees. Click Zoom key. You can zoom in on the pattern. Click the mirror key. It will show pattern mirror. Click the simulation color key. It will show color page. Click the background key to select the background color. Click the embroidery color 1 or 2 separately. Select the thread color and turn it off to back to pattern add interface. Click the end key to end into embroidery interface. Click the frame key to preview the embroidery position and adjust the frame position by arrow. Click thread tension adjustable button. The bigger the number, the bigger the tension. The smaller the number, and the smaller the tension. Put down the presser foot. Click start or stop button to start sewing. After few stitches, Click Start or Stop button and cut the thread. And then click Start or Stop button to continue the sewing. While sewing, press button plus, minus can adjust the speed. When stop sewing, change the thread according to the prompt. When the sewing is finished, click the car line. The machine automatically do thread trimmer. Lift the presser foot. Take out the embroidery frame to complete the embroidery operation. If the bottom thread runs out, after restore the bottom thread correctly, click Advance and Retreat key to adjust the needle numbers. The maximum adjust numbers can be reached to 100. If click Coil Select button, can end into next stitch color embroidery. Part 7. USB input Attention! The input of the pattern size cannot be greater than 100 mm by 235 mm. Please use letters or 0 to 9 numbers for the name of pattern file. Pattern input Insert the U disk into USB port. Power run. Enter the main interface. Then click the Set key. Click the Pattern Import. Click the Pattern file that needs to be imported. Then click the Import key to import the pattern into the machine. After the import completes, click the Back button to return to the main interface. Click USB icon to check all the imported pattern files. The user may import the files as needed delete operation. Part 8. Maintenance Power off Open the cover Take out the bobbin 
Spread the needle plate B on both sides to move in its own direction. Take out needle plate B. Take out the inner kettle. Remove the dust on inner kettle, inner rotating shuttle, and outer kettle, outer rotating shuttle with brush. After cleaning, install the inner kettle in properly way. Roll the hand wheel to check if the machine is in good condition. Install bobbin. Install needle plate B. Cover the transparent bobbin cover. 